Hey, we are back for a third and last division problem. Now, the two d division problems I showed you before this video are the ones that are going to be on the quiz today. This one is just to show you um, what long division looks like with a decimal place when you're doing long division. Okay, so just like our regular long division with whole numbers, we have checklist. Does McDonald's sell cheeseburgers? We need three of those, so I'm going to put three of those off to the side. Does McDonald's sell cheeseburgers? Now, even though there's a decimal, you can't be scared. You're going to solve this problem as if the decimal wasn't even there. So you take the same steps, nothing changes. So, wow, thanks. Yeah, I know. Pretty easy, right? So solve it like it was 255. So how many times can 5 go into 2? Zero. Divide, multiply, 0 times 5 is 0, subtract, 2 minus 0 is 2, check, 2 is less than 5, we are good, and bring down your next number, which is a 5. Okay, now you're going to divide, back to the top, 5 into 25. How many times can 5 go into 25? Ooh, 5 times. So I'm going to put the 5 at the top, multiply, 5 times 5 is 25. I'm going to subtract 5 minus 5 is 0, 2 minus 2 is 0. I'm going to check 0 is indeed less than 5. And we're going to bring down our next number. Leave that decimal point alone. We're going to act like right now it's not even there. Then you're going to bring down the 5. And we're going to say back to the top again. Okay, how many times can 5 go into 5? Oh, it can go in there once without going over. Multiply. 1 times 5 is 5, subtract, 5 minus 5 is 0, check, 0 is indeed less than 5, and then bring down, we have nothing else to bring down. So, you're like, wait, but that decimal, it's still there. We just solved the problem like it was 255. We ignored the decimal for now. But, don't forget about the decimal at the end. When you are done, all you have to do, grab a different color here, is bring the decimal up exactly where it's from. Just bring it straight up. So now we can say that 25 and 5 tenths divided by 5 gives us 5 and 1 tenth. It's that easy, friends. You can do it. I believe in you. Have a great day. I'll see you soon.